Welcome back guys, this is Sam's Automotive bringing you another episode how DIY yourself. Alright, today I'm going to show you guys how to test a glow plug relay. I have seen a couple of videos out there uh, testing this circuit here um, and they say put a power here and and check uh, for 12 volts in this one and 12 volts in this other one here and then it should pass a current here uh, that's kind of inaccurate guys um, again this video is just to show you how to test the circuit okay um, this relay <clears throat> it has four prongs as you can see it has an I has an S and it has these two leads here okay so what you got to do here guys just to test the relay okay the way the way this relay works okay it's pretty simple uh, this glow plug relay is for a 2001 I think 2003 down 2001 use this type of relay okay as you can see, I have three different type of relays, but they all work the same. All right, so what you wanna do is, you wanna have, in, in, this, uh, in this testing, if you don't have any tool at all, uh, it's pretty simple. What you're gonna hear is a clicking if it's good, uh, but myself, uh, I have two testers. I have a bolt, a bolt meter and I also have a power proof. Okay, so it's really easy for me to find out what's going on here. All right, so again, uh, this is how this relay face like that. As you can see, that one is the same thing. And that one is the same thing. All right, so these relay, they don't have to be ground, okay? So the way, again, I'm going to try to explain this as easy as I can. All right, the way this really works is it gets a 12 power from the battery, okay, which is going to be the orange uh, right there, okay. So you'll get hot the whole time, okay. You'll have the signal, okay which it's hot again uh, this is going to be hot that's coming that's coming from the ignition and that should have a, um, a 12 volts at the um, at the uh, what do you call it at the, at the beginning all right so if you shut it down it probably it's going to have zero but it usually uh, powers the whole time all right now this other guy here that's gonna be hot because the way this thing works is with the oil sender in this unit which I'm gonna show you which what it is okay this is the oil I'm touching this this sensor here that's your oil temp temperature sensor. And you have back here, and this intake on the back of it, you're gonna have, which is the, uh, the what do you call it? The temperature sensor, okay? And that's just for the, um, as far as the, how hot is the, uh, the, uh, the temperature, all right? Okay, so since we know that, all right, <clears throat> this relay is going to be grounded by that computer, okay? When the computer finds that the air is, uh, say, uh, 50 degrees or, say, 50, and then the oil, it's about 70, whatever. In other words, when, it, when, when you have this severe cold weather okay that's when the computer gets the reading 
from that air temperature sensor and the oil sensor grounds this terminal then the circuits close internally here and put power to this side okay and that's going to be the side you see there it's a yellow and a brown okay that's going to go to your to your glow plugs the brown is to the left the the yellow is i'm sorry the yellow is to the to the left and the brown is to the right okay so they go to the, the to the glow plug okay so knowing how the system works okay Usually you can based on just saying um, with the ignition on, you should get power here. Like I've seen a lot of guys, uh, they put a bolt, uh, test light or a bolt meter here. They say, put the ignition on. And they put the ignition and nothing happened. Now they think it's the relay. But again, as you remember, I told you, this solenoid, it has to be ground in order to work. Okay, if you don't ground it, you're not going to work. It's not going to work. And it's ground by that computer. Okay, guys? Very important. All right. So, again, how are you going to test this uh, relay? Very easy. Okay. You want to come here. You want to grab this guy here. Careful enough, you want to put power to this terminal and the S terminal okay and this side don't have it but you can just get the reference it's going to be this one and this one you want to power this two all right once you power this you put your voltmeter and direct current DC all right so power your 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 uh your bolt meter grounded okay grounded on the battery okay then you want to come and take a test in this lead okay this test lead is going to have it's going to have 12 volts if we do that right okay there you go it's 12, 34, okay. I'm touching this lead here with the eye, all right. As you can see, I, I touch it. Goes 12, 34, all right. Now, in this lead, you should have nothing. Zero, okay. And here it comes the magic. Pay attention, guys. Uh, I'm gonna try to do it. Um, I don't know if I can be available to show you this, but um, yeah, I don't think I can because I'm gonna need the other the other hand. But what you want to do is you want to put a ground in the eye. Okay, when you put a ground in the eye, you're gonna hear. Um, you're going to hear a click on this relay. Now, real quick, let me just grab one of this, um, one of this nut here, and I'm going to try to put it in here. So maybe I can tight this, the, I can tight this guy down here. All right, let me see if I find the other ones. This is not the correct one. Uh, this is too small. Let me see. Uh, I think I have one here. I'm just gonna grab this one. So what I what I'm trying to do here is I'm trying to smash my lead with this guy here, so you guys can see what I'm gonna do next. All right, real quick. There we go. All right, that's perfect right there. Awesome. All right, so there, 
Okay, so again, power here and power here. Ground in that side. And then you'll check continuity here, bolt, okay? And then you're gonna hear something. So find yourself a good ground, a wire, anything, all right? In this case, I have my power pump. So I want you guys to hear this. I want you guys to hear this. Oops, 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 oops. Just be careful when you're doing this test here. Let me see. You, heard, you guys hear that? All right, so apparently here I'm doing something wrong here, guys. It's um, when you're doing this, I get nervous when, when I'm working in these things because uh, I got power here and I got power here. All right, I'll put you in hold, guys, and I'm going to set up this really good so that I want to short things out here. Okay, hold on. Okay, guys, so I think I got it. So I want you to see uh, what's happened here when I put ground here. See the spark? Now see what happened here. Okay, so I have my lead on that uh, continue right there on the next pole, okay? And I want you to see there what happened when I put ground here. See that? 12.09, all right? And you can hear the click as well. See that? All right? And that's how you test a glow plug. Alrighty, guys. Uh, glow plug relay. All right. So hopefully this video was helpful to you guys. God bless you. And you guys have a great day. Thumbs up. Subscribe, guys.